If I start at this initial side and I measure an angle below the axis like this, then I'm going the other direction in the clockwise direction. I'm going to, by definition, define and, and be looking at negative angles. So let me give you an example of that. And then I have an angle that comes down something like this. But for whatever reason, I do not take and look at this angle over here. That's a positive angle. Instead, I start here and I go and look at the angle below. I start sweeping down below like this in a clockwise fashion. This means this is a negative angle. So it's negative 60 degrees in this case. So when you see negative angles, it just means angles that are measured below the x-axis. And these angles, of course, you can measure negative angles all the way around. Right? But if you start here and you go in the counterclockwise direction, you're measuring positive angles. So one direction you're measuring positive angles, the other direction you're measuring negative angles. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.